Hola Let's go Kita dah boleh sambung ya Main mission Shopping loo Welcome to the automatic Oh, I should get some of those too. My mental energy has been lagging a little. Eh, la ila. Thanks for visiting the automatic. Okay. Welcome back. Good to see you again. Good selection. Smart. Keep one of those in your pocket or nine if you want to please use your purchases responsibly. Yep. No bowling. Almost time for my afternoon nap. Shouldn't you be wearing a mask? Nah, I've got it in my blood. Hey, Ford. Shoes aren't ready yet. What you doing there? Time to disinfect these bowling shoes. Bowling. I think I'm losing the fight. Would you mind if I stepped inside your mind for a minute? Sure. Better than you stepping inside one of these shoes. I tell you, it's like Germ City in there. How much am I bowling? Remember where I parked that thing? The couple that came here on the date, Ford and Lucy? Yeah, they were just here a second ago. Cute couple. Any idea where they went? They went bowling. Da -ha! <laughs> that away. Ford? Hmm, wow. Ford and Lucretia dated? Party, your lane is ready. Crawler and Mux. Keep the balls in the lanes, please. Sorry. Here goes nothing. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, wow. Wait, wait, wait. Whoa! Okay, it's just like a giant. Hey, look at that giant Ford head. I wonder if there's any brains in there. More than you got, Sonny. <laughs> the end is coming! Oh, give it a rest, guy! Death is coming from above! <laughs> uh... He's dead. Guy was right. All hail Guy the Prophet. If there's a piece of Ford's mind in here to reconnect, I'll bet it's up in that giant bowling pin head. Listen to 
This is the sky. The end is nigh. Look to the sky. We're all going to die. This is the sky. The end is nigh. Look to the sky. We're all going to die. This is the sky. The end is nigh. Look to the sky. We're all going to die. Please don't mind me. Do that again. I'm gonna make you so sick. Yeah, there's only ah. Oh, ain't so tough without your bomb. Ah, you can't be. Hey man, watch the rush. Don't you know the world's ending? <laughs> hey man, hey, you one. down by that ball polisher. A little help. Whoa. Okay, it's just like a giant pop bubble. Made of bricks. This guy needs a duffel bag tab. Can you give me a little boost, fella? Huh? Don't attack the messenger. I think... He needs to fix that rail crane. And you're gonna help me, okay? What's that sound? <laughs> Almost there, buddy. Just keep rocking. The hell is this? Run that ball polisher up yeah, here. Oh, it's too good. slick to ride now. Let's roll. Let's go to Super Monkey Ball. I know what you're up to, kid. What? Ew. This slime is so sticky. You know it. The kids just love it. Do I know the best places to take you all on vacation or what? Yeah! Yay! Yep! <laughs> ah. Ah Out of my way! I gotta get to that giant Ford head before the cis day. broken rail on the Kingpin Express before someone arrests me. This stuff wasn't in the way I told you right in that sick half-life. Yeah, right. You're afraid. No, you're so brave. Why don't you do it? I'm going to. I'm just waiting for my muscles to warm up. <laughs> this stuff. Now, let's lay some track. When the world gets destroyed, 
I want it to be perfect. Yes. <laughs> Fix the Kingpin Express. Buddy, that ain't the Kingpin Express. That's the foul line. It'll take you across town, but you gotta transfer to the Kingpin. At this time of day, though, you're better off taking a... Man, this thing's big. <laughs> what muscle? Thanks for the ride. What was that? Interesting. This is the guy. guy. The end is nigh. Look, Look to the sky. sky. We're all gonna die. Got you. Why didn't you go home, Sonny? Giant Jim. The messenger. Oh no. 
Oh no. Okay, now no crossing the foul line. Okay, I'll okay. fight, okay. Sorry, elevator is uh, having some issues. Issues? No elevator rides for the moment, I'm afraid. Come back later. Our elevator needs a moment. <laughs> When is quick time? As soon as we get this building up, now let's get to work. Hey, everybody! Ella's working again, so don't bother hoofing it upstairs on your own, whatever you do. What's the point? Hey, I just stop. Oh, come on, Elle, we talked about this. I'm gonna duck you pay for that. Chef <laughs> Oh, dang, gang boy. Do it. No. 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 Yeah. Attention! Our beloved elevator now goes all the way to the top. No need to climb up there on your own. In summary, all is well in the world again. Uh, except, of course, that it's ending. Oh no. I'm so yelled. Third floor coming up. I'm so proud of you. It's about time. Now, let's get to work. Don't quit now. We're almost oh, done. Cool. Oh, it's a giant gem over there. Titan. I think this Ford Lucretia romance was more serious than I realized. Hey, it's Ford and Lucy! Sorry! <laughs> Didn't mean to ruin your date! Hey, bowlers aren't allowed in here. Now get for a spray. Here. Don't touch that. That's private. Oh! I had to this time. You and... you... loved her? Her name is Lucretia, but I called her Lucy. 
And even from that first date in that grimy bowling alley, I knew. Knew that it was too good to last forever? Hey, all relationships end one way or another. Well, I just didn't think it would end so badly. Hey, cheer up. Even gutter balls return. Eventually. <sighs> so sad. Rasputin. Agent Crawler, how do you feel? I've done a terrible thing. And so have you. But we just wanted to undo what Maligula did to you. Maligula didn't do this to me. That's the first thing I've learned in here. The rest, you're gonna have to see for yourself. Ford, what is it? See for yourself. Kubur! sure I want to see this oh no I don't think you want to see this at all <laughs> what Falling with style. Hey Ford, what's the deal with the Deep Six treatment? I did what I had to do. I loved her after all. Wait, what? Someday when you fall in love, you'll understand. <laughs> so scary. What's going on here? What did you want me to see? I couldn't let her go free. She was a danger to the world. Even though it was the world that made her dangerous. Lucretia? Where is she? Safe. She's safe. Well, she was. But we all were. Huh. <laughs> Not anymore.
bag. What? Should I slow you down? Yeah, 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 yeah. Time bubble. Whatever I'm supposed to know, just spit it out. I had to hide her from the world because they'd never forgive her. And I had to hide her from me because I'd never forget her. Where? Where did you hide her? She's with family. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> That's your grandparents, Laszlo and Morona. They drowned in the Valermo Dam disaster, remember? What? No! Grandpa Laszlo died there, but Grandma made it out and came to live with my father. No, Raz. She didn't. Ford, I just saw her today. <gasps> no, you didn't. It's not Grandma? Maligula. She was defeated, but alive. I snuck her away from the I put her in the astrolathe. One of Otto's inventions. Created to make permanent alterations to the psyche. And I used it to isolate and neutralize the part of her psyche that was... A murderer? Problematic. And I had my Lucy. <laughs> I put her in the astrolabe of Otto's inventions, created to make permanent alterations to the psyche. And I used it to isolate and neutralize the part of her psyche that was... A murderer? ...problematic. And I... But I knew the world would never forgive her, so I had to hide her somewhere safe. Where, Ford? Family. Your family, Aquaros. Oh no. I hid her among her family, Rasputin. Among your family. No, no, no! I projected memories and feelings on your father so he would accept her. Accept Maligula? Yes. As your grandmother. No! Nona? <coughs> Let me go! Listen, Raz. I know you're mad. My great aunt killed my grandma. And so you made us babysitter for 20 years? Now look it. You spring this news on your family now, their memories will unravel, and there's no telling how they'll react. So? They might try to kill her. If Lucretia is attacked, if she feels the need to defend herself, that dark spirit could reawaken inside her. Maligula really could rise again. What did you do? You're right to be mad, Rasputin. I was young. 
I made a terrible mistake. But we need to deal with that after we get control of this incredibly dangerous situation. She's not there. Probably wandered off into the woods again. She keeps doing that. I know where she's going. The Psychonaut started out here, in the heart of the forgetful forest. There's a compound deep in these woods, protected from intrusion by psychic devices, traps, and illusions. I think Lucy's trying to get in, trying to go home. Remember, mm. mad later, mission first. Now stick close. I'll show you how to get through. I hope I didn't lose him in the woods. Wow. It's really all still here. The Great Needle Gulch. So much history here. I mean, this is where you assembled the team that would become the Psychonauts. This is where you first discovered Cytanium. Where Otto made his first psychoactive devices. Where Cassiopeia wrote her books. Where Helmut Fulbert workshopped his psychodicy. Where Bob Zanotto and Compton Bull pioneered communication with plants and animals. And where... where... I mean... This is where it all began. No, Rad. This is where it all ended. Dang.
Ya está. Gira tangga Entah balik hmm. No use Oh what What Is it lie? Can you tell me about this place? I... Oh, I think... I think I used to keep the cinnamon over there. Oh, we don't have much time. Her old memories are coming back. What's going to happen? Listen, Raz. This compound... We got into some pretty far-out stuff here. I've read about the kind of stuff they don't write about in true psychic tales, okay? We all pushed each other to go farther, to broaden our consciousness, to open mm. every closed door in our minds. It made us defenseless, psychically. But we were in a safe place here. We had each other. Then her homeland was attacked. She insisted on helping. I begged her not to go in that condition, it's so vulnerable. Ah, uh, war brought something out in her that should have been locked away. Maligula! After the deluge, I brought her back here and closed those doors again with Maligula on the other side. How? With the astrolathe. A powerful tool we developed to make alterations to our psyches. That doesn't sound safe. Now you wouldn't understand. It was an age of exploration. But you're right. We were messing with powers we didn't understand. And now I have to clean up this mess. But I'm not the psychonaut I used to be, Rasputin. I need your help. Me? What do you need me to do? First, I need you to go to the Heptodome and prepare the astrolathe. Well, I stay here and keep a close watch on her. Be right back, Nona. Stay away from the river, booty! Chewing tobacco hidden in here. Come back. Oh, good damn bet. Interrupt, but is the astrolathe ready, Rasputin? No. Uh, where is it again? That way, in the Heptodome. Oh, don't <laughs> so this water curse on my family. The more Lucy comes in contact with water, the more likely she is to remember bad things. So I use the astrolathe to give her an unnatural fear of water. She passed it on to your father, and he passed it on to you. So, there is no curse? Rasputin, there's no such thing as magical curses. Please, <laughs> this is science. <laughs> Why didn't you just turn Lucretia into the authorities? I knew that the real Lucretia was a good person, and would be fine if we could control the Maligula complex inside her. But I knew no one would ever believe that. They'd lock her up, which would just make Maligula more angry. And more dangerous. 
Does my dad know? Your dad thinks this is his mother. He has no idea. It's his aunt. No idea that his mother has been dead for 20 years. But he might remember the truth while we are performing the procedure, as Lucy remembers who she is. How are you going to use the astrolathe? Years ago, I used it to seal the spirit of Maligula away. But she is still in there. With your help, I'm hoping we can bring it out see. and destroy it Fight forever. It. What you did to my family was wrong, Ford. You're right, Rasputin. I was young, and I panicked. But that's no excuse. I just hope we can use the astrolathe to set things right for you and your family. I'd better get that astrolathe working. That's my boy. That's my boy. <laughs> hmm. Sensing some stray thoughts around. Ooh, getting closer. Hi, yo. There are some straight lines. This is where the first Psychonauts met. And this must be the Astral Lane. No sign. Well, I'll just turn this thing on then. Well, those are thick and thorny. Hey, this that's the Yikes. the queen, the okay. I'm gonna the need a little green help. witch. This is where they sat. Time to take a spin in the brain tumbler? No. Actually, I don't want to go to the collective unconscious right now. I'll take that card. Ah, one of my regulars. We appreciate your business. Don't be a stranger. to the automatic. Let's combine that Psychor with your card so you can rank up. Ayanara Psychic. Sayonara Psychic. Honey, how big are the bees around? Oh, great. Bees love Is that the real Fieldmobile? Wow! This must be how much the Fieldmobile needs a tuna and a car wash. And actually, it smells like there's a skunk family living in there, so never mind. Lying around. Yep. Not 
Oh dang. I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, please smoke this. <laughs> Victory over bees. What's wrong, you big babies? Can't take the heat. Hope I'm not contributing to the global You, Green Needle Witch, you don't exist. You're just something someone put into my mind. Which means there's probably a very powerful psychic nearby. Another hallucination. A very solid hallucination. Oh man, are you gonna cast a spell or something? <laughs> Who are you? How did you get in here? And where was our security, eh? Cassiopeia? Author of Mind Swarm? Ford Cruller brought me through security. Ford? Ford Cruller? Came back? Oh, I knew it! I knew he would. But I'm not ready. I've been trying to fix this place up for him, but you know these bees are so demanding. Ford wants me to turn on the astrolathe, but it's covered in, well, really angry bees. Know anything about that? Oh, I think I can help you with that. I'm just happy to be useful again. Get out of my way. Ford needs me. Oh, I can tend to the queen later. Oh. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. She says. I can't talk to you anymore. Wait! Cassie! Who's she? Queen Bee, right? Killer Bee. Hmm. There's a narrow slot, but I don't think I can fit through it.
Lucy, would you sign my copy of Mind Swarm? I was wondering when you were going to ask. What took you so long? Thanks, Cassie. I didn't know my name. So, are you the Green Needle Witch? What? Why would you say such a thing? Because you're so tall. Okay, well, I do wear lifts in this thing so I can reach the upper hives, but what beekeeper doesn't do that? Because you lurk through the woods in the dark. I do my beekeeping at night because this darn bee suit is so hot. Bee suit? Because you're so pointy. Those are pine needles. They stick to the honey on my suit. I can't help it. No reason. Well, I'll admit, I have been playing into the legend a little bit. Why? I need to keep people away from here to protect it. This is a sacred place. What's up with these strange bee things? I've lost control of the bees. <laughs> They're keeping me like a prisoner here. I'm going to help get you out of here, Cassie. Shh. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> Shh. Shh. Thanks. What are you doing out here by yourself? Why don't you work out of the mother loop with the rest of the psychonauts? Oh, I never could adapt to the whole new psychonauts thing. I like to stay out here and remember the old days. Also, I want to take care of it as best I can, in case Ford and the others ever come back. Would you mind if I snuck a peek inside your mind? Oh, thank you. I haven't had a checkup since Ford went away. Had a checkup? I'm not. <laughs> it's the doctor thing. I know why you're here. Now, to whom shall I dedicate this inscription? Not that many people find their way in here these days. You must have a good head on your shoulders. Uh, definitely a big one. <laughs> now, just imagine what you could do if you were using 175% of your brain. Actually, Cassie, I need your help with something else. We're on a critical mission, but there's a swarm of bees that's making it impossible. Stop right there, young man. Nothing is impossible. If you follow the 25 simple steps I've outlined in my book. Now then, let's go show these bees what we can do when we put our minds together. There's that pesky little volume. Thank you, young man. I have been looking for this silly book forever. Wait, she was going to help me. What? This one? <laughs> oh, I'll admit the author was helpful once, when we needed the money to leave the country, but that was a long time ago. What? But when the chips were down and we needed to fight to protect our friends? Ah, worthless. Is there another Cassie book in there that could help me? They are all restricted. Dang. Hmm. Then again, maybe I could help you. If you were to help me. What? There sure. are two other books missing from my collection. Dangerous books. These are the books that got us into this horrible situation. These are the wrong books, you understand? Round them up for me. Take them out of circulation. They are overdue. Understand? Then you'll help me with the bees? I'll help you with the whole alphabet, son. <laughs> oh, dang. Oh, dang, baby girl. I think I hear some emotional baggage nearby. What?
help me find these books? I'm her favorite assistant and best assistant, and I already looked, so give it up. Banyaknya lebih. It's a big place. Alright. Bye bye, Janers. <laughs> well, this shouldn't take too wow, long. Wow, expert already. But we go tomorrow, okay? Ooh. Enabler. Support. Sensors know when something's wrong. Kill the bugs that don't belong. Seriously? Ah, that ma. Tell me you're out to save. Yes. Bye bye, Janers. <laughs> 